Hey guys, so it's here bringing you another video. Welcome back to preseason testing. Not gone great today. We have made videos. We've actually had pretty good games, but unfortunately they haven't translated into wins. So we've played three. All three games are being uploaded. Uh, but we've won one, lost two. Uh, but I'm happy with how we're playing at least. So that's why I'm continuing because again, if you don't think you're playing very well, don't keep playing. I've got plenty of content right now, so I don't actually have to keep playing. But I feel like I'm playing well enough that, yeah, keep playing today. Uh, very quickly... Uh, we have a Teemo main, one trick Teemo, and he's been autofilled support, so he, clearly he's a one trick, so he's just going to keep playing Teemo. Main band Camille is playing Scion for the first time ever. Camille looks quite, uh, sorry, Cassio looks quite good. One trick Jin, but uh, we'll see how this goes, but yeah. Leona's running Predator for some reason, which obviously is bizarre. But yeah, inting Teemo, I don't know, we'll see. It's just, again, it's the bad example of one tricks. I know we give one tricks a fairly hard time on this channel. I'm not a massive fan of one tricks. You may be surprised to know that. But to me, again, one tricks are the least flexible players in the game. And this is the perfect evidence for that. He's Teemo support. He's a one trick top lane Teemo. But because he got autofilled, he is now playing Teemo support. And what you got to ask yourself, if you're watching this game right now, would you want a Teemo support? And for, if you're the AD carry, would you want a Teemo support? The answer is no. You just flat out no. And I think that's where a lot of people, when it comes to like troll picks or off off meta picks or whatever, that's where I think a lot of people, you know, they'll comment and they'll go, oh, you know, let people play what they play. But I think those people are also the type of people that if it was on their team, then they'd have a problem with it. It's like, well... Then you should have a problem with it anyway. If your rank LP is on the line. You know. Yeah, B Blossom has made a good point, which is a true point. Is uh, you'd rather a one trick be on their champion than not, uh, not on their champion. And that is the point. Again, one tricks, they're only good at one thing generally. So they have to just play their one thing. I'd prefer if just people didn't one trick. I think that is the actual answer to the whole situation, but people are always going to one trick. Jin didn't use any sums. Yeah, so Jin died without using any sums. I don't know, maybe he's given up, annoyed he has a Teemo support or something. I've seen it before, because if he runs mid lane, I swear to God. We have been, like, insanely cursed in preseason. So many feeders and so many bad teammates. Please don't troll me, dude. Please. I'm just trying to enjoy my game. I'm just trying to enjoy my game. I don't like this guy just needs to quit the game if the, if you see yourself like this Jin, stop playing league there's no point playing it you're clearly not enjoying it oh, i missed hey neon moon how's preseason going very annoying being trolled. I'll LPP report, obviously. But, I don't know. I'm just going to keep going, because some people said, Huzz, go bot. No. Because if I go bot, this Jin wins. Like, he wins the troll. I don't want to, his troll to be... Like, I don't want him to benefit from him trolling. Yeah. 
He's trolling because he has a Teemo support. And I think he inted at the beginning of the game because he died without summoner use. An enemy has been slain. Again, he's probably typing, like, go bot. Nope. I have no interest in going bot lane. Hey, Apple. No, I'm staying mid. Again, I'm not letting a troll win, but right? screw that. I don't see why I'd want to let a troll win by me going bot lane when I'm a mid laner. If I wanted to play bot, I'd queue as bot. It's not my fault that he's not enjoying the game, that he should probably just quit. Well, hopefully right will pub him. Uh, the pleb points have been refunded. Jeebus refunded all the pleb points a few days ago. That was a good cane ult. Oh. Teemo got one kill. Because that's the thing. As we said earlier, it is dumb that a Teemo is playing Teemo support. It's because he's a one trick. But he is trying. He's not trolling. Like, clearly. Wait, it is AD Scion. Wait, this Scion's dumb. What? This Scion's playing AD Scion, but with Grasp. That's weird. You don't... I think you don't... If you're going AD in Scion, you don't run Grass because that kind of defeats the point. Yeah, I agree. Like, Teemo support isn't great, but it can work... Well, Teemo support will work a lot better than a lot of other things in League. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I can't 1v1 the cast because I'm a level down because the Jin's trolling. Zorg, don't... Like, again, I don't know if you're trying to be annoying or anything. Please don't be backing a troll. That's just going to annoy me and pretty much everybody in chat. Not into trolling here. Scion is inting, pretty much. It's basically, yeah, it's a winnable game because they have the Scion, I reckon. We're going to have a very, like, by the way, Kled isn't based yet. He just has a cull and he's five and one. What the hell? Hey, Moon. He just bought a Bork in one go. Look him up, look him up. 
Nice. Wait, why why have I traded Jin for then having a Teemo in my lane? What's going on? Go away. Let me have solo XP, please. In before Jin typed, I'll go back bot lane if Teemo isn't there. Oh, nice Java. Your work permit to Canada's been approved. Nice. I really want to try poutine. I've never had poutine before. I know it's like pretty basic. That's like fries, gravy, and cheese. Again, I I've heard it's very like, it's a very big thing that you have to have cheese curds, not just cheese for some reason. What the hell just happened? Did Leona flash over me? What would be better this game? Would Crown be better? Honestly, yeah. Like, Crown is just so good. I don't see why I wouldn't be buying this item. Poutine's one of your favourite foods. Honestly, it sounds like it would be one of mine to be there. Oh, that was a nice cue. Mount! Mount! He's alive. Oh, 40 health. Nice. I didn't buy that, right? No. Oof. I thought I just bought an elixir, but I can't afford it. Thank God. Hey, plants. What the hell does crown do? All right, so crown is broken. So because, if you we all know, League's damage is just silly, you are safeguarded when it activates, reducing incoming damage by 75%. So basically, you can't get bursted anymore. So why wouldn't you buy this item when the, the damage in League is just busted? There's no reason that you wouldn't buy this item. Oh. So literally you just can't get one shot anymore when when the ability is like active. Which is great because again, Riot's done nothing about the damage in the game, it's still incredibly high. But now we have a tool to like not get one shot as a mage. I just see mages basically buying this item every game. Which again, to me, is just going to be a mess. If if that does happen, that geez, the, the 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 percentage that people are buying this item, maybe Riot will kind of go. Oh, I wonder why. Maybe it's because mages can't survive in a game that the damage is too high, and now this item is actually letting mages play the game. Yes. Ah! I'm okay. So why the hell, man, did the Jin have a baby rage, troll me in lane, troll Teemo in lane by leaving, and now he's playing normally? Like, what the hell? If you're going to be someone like that, at least follow through. Like, that's the way. I know it sounds dumb because it's like, Hoz, you're going to win LP this game. Yeah, it's good. It just shows this guy has no backbone. Yeah, and I didn't let him win. I stayed mid lane. Screw that guy. I'm the mid laner. I don't have to go bot just because you're raging. Screw that noise. Why do you have a team of support? He's a one trick. He only plays Teemo. So the Scion's doing the kind of typical Scion things. Zero seven. It's about. Right. He got his mount back. I was thinking about TPing earlier, but. I also was thinking maybe Kled will just get away. Mm. 
I'm trying. Well, Predator's meta right now, and with with the uh, Viga, I wanted to call him Heimer for some reason. Um, it just gives him the utility of getting to a position to land a cage. Basically, is what I, my understanding of Viga with Predator. Because sometimes you you're getting close to a team fight, and you just can't quite get it. And obviously, you'd like to land it perfectly to stun somebody. But even in a team fight situation, if you can just land it in the middle of a team fight, it's a good thing. Ah. Objective bounty. So the Scion is literally doing the int split push Scion build. He's bought a hull breaker first item and everything. And he's 1 and 8. Close. Nice. I don't know why Leona's got Predator. Again, that to me is weird. Like, Leona does not want the domination tree at all. So, you know when we've said, oh, the meta, the Predator, predator meta right now? That's taking it too far. I'm getting outskilled on by an Echo. Yay. Oh, he went Crown as well. God, Echo with Crown is going to be so obnoxious. That champion doesn't die as it is. That was bad. Let's go, baby! Silas with Crown, yep. God, imagine those champions. They literally just won't die. The main difference you've actually seen with Buffs, he doesn't actually int. He just trades his life for towers sometimes. Yeah. I mean, he knows what he's doing. That's the, No, it's, it's more that he knows what he's doing and the, all the copycats don't know what they're doing. So he knows when it's a good time to trade a life for a tower and stuff like that. Like, he knows when to time it. Most people just look at his playstyle and go, oh, he's just inting for towers. He's not. He is actually thinking it through. Where all the copycats, they're not thinking it through. They've just got it in their head that's like, wait, int for towers? Okay. He's not doing that. He's timing it at the right time. You can't just int for towers because literally you'll be giving too much gold away to the enemy team. That safeguard literally made me do no damage to that echo then. Hey, Arcanine. Rampage. Oh, you're my best friend in the world you must defend. Hello there. Oh. Echo. He literally, this Scion, he's actually doing that playstyle of I'm never grouping and I'm only split pushing. <laughs> oh, God. That is quite funny. I presume he's dead again. Even like the really weak Jin should be able to kill him. Why is he standing next to him, though? He's dead. Yeah, and that's the thing. Weirdly, that playstyle has been buffed because of objective bounties. Because <laughs> he's very likely going to be feeding enough that he'll basically give objective bounties to the enemy team alone, like a Scion. So it's very likely that, like, Scion, that playstyle of Scion has just been buffed. Which is kind of funny. It's very weird to me that the Jin decided to troll the whole early game. It, like, literally hurt my early game and made, like, a lot. I was, he stole XP, he was stealing farm, and now he's playing to win. It's like... What? Shut down. Hopefully they get banned. Yeah, so when the safeguard, by the way, guys, when the safeguard is active, 
you gain ability power. So I, right now I'm gaining 22 ability power for three seconds while I get safeguarded. So you're actually gaining strength for even fighting and stuff. So it's just, again, it's a no-brainer on a lot of mages. Maybe, again, I played Xerath the other day, got very fed. I don't think Xerath needs it because like you're so, so high range that people really shouldn't be getting to you anyway. But other champions... Teemo, block it! Oh. But why is Sion even grouping? He's got Hullbreaker. It's really dumb if he groups, because he's got the Hullbreaker build. Feels weird, man. Yeah, he's legit just wanting the team fight. Oh my god, that cane. Oh my god, that damage that cane just did. Woo-wee! I mean, it's broken. It is broken in some aspects, Remon. So, like, Remon said it's actually not that broken. You can proc it and then re-engage. For a lot of things in League, they're only a time to go for, like, an, like an assassin that one-shots a mage really for free. Is they'll go for the all-in. That's their engage. They, a lot of assassins don't have a tool to proc the safeguard, back away, then re-engage. A lot of assassins don't do that. They go all-in in one go. And that's what safeguard stops. And it even stops a mage one shot on you with one big mage combo. Like, yeah. All I know is I'm probably going to be buying it pretty much most games that I'm not playing a really long range artillery mage. Because I just don't see any reason why I wouldn't. I wasn't stealing that. Wait, what? Hello, Sion. <sighs> what do you, Baron? This Kate is very bad. So again, this also game shows about persevering. This is a good video in my opinion, because we literally have had a troll and we didn't give in to it. I stayed mid lane. I am I am the mid laner, screw you. And we we're gonna end up winning the game, you know? It just shows you don't have to give in to trolls. Trolls are the, trolls are the coward players, not you. Sell that for Zonya. Your team has Have I seen Eternals yet? No. I'll be seeing it not this weekend, next weekend, I think. I think, well, we're either watching Venom 2 or we're just watching Eternals. I'm more leaning to Eternals, but I think Queen Pleb might be more leaning towards Venom. But we'll see. We might have to rock, paper, scissors to which one we're watching. I'm top. Why not both? Oh, God. I don't think we can do both. Hamilton's speed today hasn't been that good? No. Oh. oh, hello. Oh, I tried to get in the way. I tried. I tried so hard. 
Yeah, Hamilton did a, is doing a great thing, man. Like, obviously, the region that they're racing in is a bit... Oh, hello. It's a bit not good for human rights, as we all know. And uh, Lewis Hamilton's like, I don't care. Literally just talking about it, basically, openly. So, so what are they going to do? Lop him in jail? You ain't going to lop Lewis Hamilton in jail. Like, a lot of people, I think, even forget Lewis Hamilton, believe it or not, he's a sir. Sir Lewis Hamilton. Can't be lop... <laughs> oh, Zonius is on the wrong button! Wah! Oh, that cane! He just won't die. What's a sir? A knight. In the UK, we still have knighthoods. Um, and Lewis got knighted uh, about a year ago, I'd say. A lot of people don't know that Lewis is a knight. They don't really mention it much in F1, I think. It, 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 honestly, Lewis probably, as asked, don't mention it too much, knowing him. But it's, yeah, it's a nice tradition. It's, it's for people that have done certain accolades in life that basically they're a good representation of the UK. Knighthoods are also taken away from people uh, if, you know, they get into some trouble. But yeah. What can I do to get knighted? I'll, you need to do a lot of stuff for the world. A lot of charity work and all of that. Yeah, Sir Ian McKellen, Alex, Sir Alex Ferguson. There's quite a, well, there's a lot. Elton John, I think, is a Sir. And there's also people that you, you probably have never even heard of is also a Sir. Um, but they just do other things. Oh, sorry. I kicked the cable. Hello. I kicked the cable. Uh, I'm going to give the cane it. And yes, I'm still reporting the gin, by the way. Don't worry about that. I'll still LPP report him. So we went 13.66 plus 18 LP and damage. Not crazy damage because, again, this guy kind of screwed me over. <laughs> it would have been nice if I actually had a proper lane phase, you know. But yeah, we will report the gin. Hopefully, right can deal with that because nine times out of ten the mid laner me in question would have gone ah screw it i'll go bot lane no i'm not doing that it's not my fault that he's trolling screw that for a laugh all right i'll, I'll type the lpp report after obviously i will throw a normal report on him too these people are very angry with each other like very angry and they just seem to be hating on the scion mainly and, well, to be fair, they're probably really angry at each other because they literally lost a game that we had a troll gin at the beginning. So, yeah, that isn't good for them. Anyway, they're going a bit nuts. 18 LP, though, is good. Um, 18 LP is always nice. So if you guys enjoyed the video, do throw a like on the video. Throw a comment, throw a subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. Call down the reckoning to bring back hope and peace. Restore our Regime.